free and declare that that wilderness season is over in the mighty name of Jesus and you're coming forth with Hello dear my beautiful people, welcome, I welcome you back to the channel. This is your girl Sharian here with another word. So guys, just a few minutes ago I was in uh, praise and worship, just admiring and worshiping the Holy Spirit. I just got so emotional and I said no, I can't go on here like this. And the Holy Spirit said do it. <laughs> God is so merciful. He is so good. So I have a word to share with you guys. Um, I have a word for someone today. A beautiful word. God says that you are moving at a new speed. The Holy Spirit is moving you at a new speed, child of God. How many of you know that God can redeem the time in split seconds? Everything and the time that you have lost, God is a time redeemer. He can redeem that time that you have lost. He says in his word, he gave me Joel 2.25 and it says, And I will restore to you the years that the locusts have eaten, the canker worms and the caterpillar and the palmer worms, my great army which I send among you. How many of you, you know that God can redeem at the time that you've lost in a split second? He is God, he is almighty, and he can do it. The Lord reminded me of this dream and he gave me this word. I think I mentioned it in one of my last video a few months ago where I was about to board this flight um, and I was with a group of friends, about two friends, and all of a sudden, the two friends just disappeared, they vanished. And so I was un, unsure of if I was born in the right flight. And so I was in the line, and I remember there was a big, long, long line. And I was thinking, boy, should I stay in this line or should I step out? And I thought to myself in a dream, if I step out in of this line, I'll have to get in the, I'll have to go to the back of the line. And uh, nevertheless, I decided to step out because I thought I was at the wrong gate. All of a sudden, I saw someone that I knew that was about to board this flight. And so then I felt confident that I was on the right flight. And so when I looked, to step back into the line I realized there's only three persons in front of me about two or three person the line was extremely short and I'm thinking in the dream how could this line be this short I just saw that there was a big big long line and a split second guys I saw just three people standing in line and so as soon as I got to the door of this plane the door closed it was as though as the plane was just waiting for my arrival and uh, I got into the plane and I could not sit guys because this plane as soon as the door shut the plane began to take off like super fast and I'm like trying to hold on because this plane is moving at such a fast speed and is about to go up in the air and all of a sudden guys I was taken to a first class seating um, where I sat and then all of a sudden someone came and told me you're not come join us and they upgraded me to an even higher level um, of seating and so guys this dream stood out to me when the Lord said to me moving at a new speed that dream came back to me and so it is evident that certain things are that's happening in my life now is moving at such a fast speed. And so I'm here to tell somebody that when God is ready for you, he will restore the time. And he is about to restore the time for many of his children in the mighty name of Jesus. The enemy have tampered with your life. 
um, from a young age and God wants to redeem that time. He says in Joel 2, 25, that he will restore unto you the years that the canker worms and the caterpillar and the locusts have eaten in the mighty name of Jesus. God is about to restore time, child of God. And so God is saying to many of his children, stay, stay where you are you are at the place that god wants you to be when the lord is ready he is going to restore you in the mighty name of jesus many of you it's your time to be restored some of you are still in the wilderness but i can guarantee you when the lord is ready he will restore unto you his word cannot come back to him void and so he will do what he says he will do. Believe it, children of God, because God is about to restore what have been stolen from you. In the mighty name of Jesus, I decree and declare, I prophesy over you that your years are being restored in the mighty name of Jesus. The enemy thought that he had your life in the palm of his hands, but when God says enough is enough, no, he's not playing games when he says enough is enough and for many of you you have been in the wilderness long enough and god is saying to you child of god that enough is enough you are about to go at a fast speed god is about to redeem the time that you have lost the time that have been stolen in the mighty name of jesus so i decree and declare over you child of god that you will be moving at a fast speed that your time will be restored in jesus mighty name i just want to say a quick pray father in the mighty name of jesus we thank you for your son for your daughter we thank you, O oh Lord, that you are the God that redeems time in the mighty name of Jesus. We speak speed for time in the mighty name of Jesus. We decree and declare over your children, Father, that they are being redeemed and restored for the lost time that they have lost, for the stolen time that the enemy have tampered with all these years in the mighty name of jesus i decree and declare that time is being restored that you are moving at a fast speed in the mighty name of jesus i decree and declare that that wilderness season is over in the mighty name of jesus and you are coming forth with all that god has for you that with all in the mighty name of jesus i decree and declare that the glory of the lord is upon you child of god i decree and declare that favor the favor of god is upon you in jesus mighty name name and let everyone say amen thank you lord for all that you're doing and all that you are about to do in jesus mighty name so guys that is the word i thank you all for tuning in i love you guys so much stay blessed stay tuned and until my next one bye